Hey gang, so I'm coming at you with a very special review today. Normally I review props and the like, but there's a new company that started up with a really unique niche. It's the brainchild of Cassandra Morrison, who's a super talented hooper and juggler, and she started her own company, producing travel bags for props. So for most of my prop spinning career, I've had it pretty easy because poi will fit into just about anything. Now that I've added double stats to my repertoire, it's made travel a little bit more challenging. For a long time, I was using an old camp chair bag to lug my staves around, and it was far from ideal. It tore a lot and had to be repatched all the time. So for a long time, I had actually thought myself about asking a friend who was handy with a sewing machine to help me make a better bag to lug my staves around with. Cassandra beat me to the punch, however. So. I'm going to start out by saying that her bags are freaking awesome, but I want to give you more detail on this because not only are they amazing, Cassandra totally took a bunch of feedback I gave her and made the bags even better, at least for my purposes. So let's talk basics first, shall we? Each of her bags is made of a really durable canvas with these lovely Velcro pouches on the outside. The inside has a soft lining and there's both a shoulder strap as well as something kind of like a briefcase style handle on the outside. I usually sling the bag over my shoulder and it gives me pretty easy access to these outside pouches as well as a really convenient way to carry the staves. As a really beautiful and personal touch, Cassandra also ships her products in this really beautiful little package that includes a thank you note and a bow. It's things like this that reinforce how much she cares about you as a customer and really makes you feel valued. Now, in and of itself, the bags are beautiful and super durable, but I talked Cassandra into making a couple modifications that take them from being beautiful and useful to absolutely indispensable. So first, the shoulder strap was originally just sewn straight to the side of the bag and it created some really awkward pinch points. Um, the joint has now been replaced with a clip that has a little bearing on it. Uh, so now the strap can move a lot more freely and it can be removed entirely if we prefer. Now the much more awesome part is an inside pocket that she added for me. You see, the first bag that I got had a small pocket on the inside, but I quickly noticed that when I carried around both my fire staves as well as my practice staves, I'd get soot all over the inside of the bag as well as my practice staves. I asked Cassandra to make an internal compartment specifically for the fire tools to keep them from getting soot all over everything else, and she totally delivered on it. There's now this lovely pocket that's the full length of the bag, and that gets covered by a Velcro flap to separate the fire tools and keep them apart from your other staves. To be honest, this takes care of pretty much all of my prop needs right now. I can stuff my poi inside one of the inside or outside pockets, as well as have all my staves fit comfortably inside, and I can even make sure that I've always got my fire staves on me. I've used this bag extensively now, traveling to Flame and Monkey See, Monkey Do, and it's an absolute trooper. Now, I'm using this small bag, which is intended for levy wands, because my staves tend to be short, no longer than about 32 inches at most. That said, the bag is still super roomy. I can fit at least six pairs of staves in here, including my fire staves, without feeling as though the bag is too difficult to close, or that I'm putting too much pressure on the zipper. Cassandra makes bigger bags for bigger stabs that have much more room in them as well. My one and only quibble at this point is that the bag is currently set up so that if you want easy access to the outside pockets, it has to be slung from your left shoulder to your right hip, like that. Now that means the pockets are accessible to your left hand. I happen to be right-handed. It'd be nice to have a choice between the two sides, but to be perfectly honest, I completely forgot about this issue after using the bag for several weeks. So overall, I'm giving Modec Designs, and more specifically their prop bags, uh, two massive thumbs up. This is a product I've wanted now for years, and Cassandra totally delivered a winner with it. I am happily endorsing these, so if you'd like to pick one up for yourself, you can go to Modec Designs on Etsy and use the promo code DREXFACTOR to get a small discount on your order. It also tells Cassandra that I sent you. Thank you for the amazing bag, Cassandra. It's getting a lot of use already, and it will likely get a whole lot more in the coming years. Thank you guys for watching, and enjoy the flow. Peace.